This is a video about how to use your Color Me A Season seasonal color fan. And as you may know, in Color Me A Season, there are four fans, which can be used for uh, technically 16 different seasons, but really it's 12. Um, so we have a spring fan. These are bright tints. We have a summer fan. Now in Color Me A Season, uh, these are a lot of pastels, or we could call them tones. Um, They're added gray to the color. Whereas for spring, it was added white to make a tint. Here's the autumn. And these are your earth tones that you would um, expect to uh, have for autumn. They are where you add black to the colors. And finally, we have um, winter. The winter fan uh, is technically called um, having, or referred to as having the pure hues, They're not made into a tint, tone, or shade. So what I have done with my uh, reference fans uh, is I've written the name of each color on the back and the season or sub-season that relates to it um, or uses it the best. So um, then what I can do is show you which colors um, are selected out as the uh, particular best for each season. So for springs, when I'm looking at the book, uh, it says that blonde or silver-haired springs are referred to as an absolute spring, um, whereas the glorious spring, or what we also hear referred to as the warm or the true spring in other systems, is a red-haired or a red-headed spring. So when I am picking out the colors for glorious spring, I am taking maybe a third out, and I'm left with these colors. Probably the warmest in the fan. So that's Glorious Spring. Another note about the Glorious Spring is that the redder your hair is, the more neutrals you want to include from the fan. So the pastel spring is referred to as the light brown or salt and pepper gray haired spring. And when I divide out the fan, it's closer to half and half of the fan that gets um, specified to be the, the pastel spring and the not pastel spring. So here's the pastel spring colors. Another note about the pastel spring fan is that you want to use generally the medium value on each uh, card. So you'll see that on the back, they say A, B, C, D, and E. And then if you're looking at it, you'll see that A is the most saturated and E is the least or the, and the lightest. And for your pastel spring, you're going to choose B and C, which are kind of medium value. So the striking spring colors in this uh, CMAS spring fan are for the um, dark brunette haired spring. In other systems, you may see a blonde um, striking spring called a clear or bright spring, and that would actually be more like an absolute spring in this system. But here's the divided out colors for striking spring. And so, 
some darker colors there for um, hair. A lot more yellows, some of the bright yellows, brown for hair. And they get a lot more of the truer reds and pinks that come in this fan. 